Coming off a big win over Cincinnati, DePaul was looking to dominate its home floor for a second straight Big East victory Sunday versus Marquette. However, the best laid plans don't always work out. Marquette had 30 points after nine minutes. That's, that's more than a 120 point pace. So we, we had to find a way to stop them, slow them down the defensive end. Coach Doug Bruno's demons indeed found a way. They stepped up on defense by blocking shots and rebounding, parts of their game Bruno said had gone awry early on. DePaul also managed to swing the momentum back their way by staying aggressive offensively. Coach Bruno said his players struggled for the first eight minutes of the game, but once they found their groove, they never looked back, clicking both on offense and defense. They held Marquette University to just 28% field goal shooting in the second half. We had to go down the other end of the floor and find some offensive rhythm. I thought we did that, and it took some time, and our players have been in a lot of close games this year, and they've been behind before, so I thought they did a great job of coming back. The comeback was partly fueled by the stellar play of sophomore forward Keisha Hampton, who had 22 points in her last meeting against Marquette and 17 in DePaul's win on Sunday. It's just not against Marquette. It's just go out there and do what I can do for my team. I mean, if I happen to have 17, 20, 19, doesn't matter. Just whatever I can get, that's the best to help my team. Yeah, Keisha's growing into an excellent college basketball player. It's, it's fun to watch her mature and get better with each game and, and each practice. The win gives the Demons a 4-4 four four record in the Big East Conference, but the fight for a postseason playoff spot has just begun. The, the Big East is just a, you know, it's just a great league. Every, every, every game is like this. The Demons will look to ride this momentum when they take on another Big East opponent in Providence Wednesday. Reporting from McGrath Arena, Kim Dunbar, DePaul Sports.